Good morning. Today is May 21st, 2022, and it's National Strawberries and Cream Day, National Waitstaff Day, and World Whiskey Day. So World Whiskey Day takes place on the third Saturday of every May, so it's not always on the 21st. Um, it's um, a big thing to encourage people to try whiskey if they've never had it before. Uh, whiskey is a distilled liquor that's made from mash, uh, mashed grains. Um, it first um, came about in the early, uh, between like 1100 and 1300 when monks traveled to Scotland and Ireland and introduced uh, distillation processes to the people living there. Um, it became um, more popular after that, and um, Scottish and Irish immigrants brought it over to the United States. Um, due to a loophole, it actually, um, during Prohibition in the United States, it was not outlawed. Um, it was sold in pharmacies as a medicinal, um, as medicine, and so... Um, pharmacies made a profit of it, and... Uh, Whiskey was not shut down, so that's a fun fact about whiskey. Uh, wait staff day, so that's your waiters and your waitresses. Um, it's a day to um, honor them and the work that they do. Um, it's a day that um, I would encourage if you go out to eat, give your uh, wait staff maybe an, an extra chip, tip um, to reward them and, and honor them this day. Uh, just a friendly reminder for your wait staff, if your food is cold or not to your liking, it's not the wait staff's fault. They're not the ones cooking your food. If there's a long wait for the restaurant, it's not the wait staff's fault. They're in charge of taking your orders and filling your things. So please don't um, skip on a tip if you don't like your food. That's not um, their fault. They're there to help and give you the service, but they're not cooking your food. So honor your wait staff today if you go out to eat. And any day that you go out to eat, don't, don't skip on your tip to your wait staff. Uh, finally, strawberries and cream day. We talked a little bit about yesterday. Um, yesterday was pick strawberries day. And so today is a day where you enjoy those strawberries you picked. It, um, you serve it with a fresh made whipped cream. It can be eaten for pretty much any meal. Strawberries, as we talked about a little yesterday, are very good for you. They're low in fat, low in calories, um, have vitamin C, fiber, folic acid, lots of good stuff for you. Um, strawberries and cream became popular um, during around the reign of Henry VIII. And because strawberries have such a short, um, they don't stay good for very long, it became kind of synonymous with wealthy and, and a wealthy the wealthy ate it because um, they became they were expensive because they were only good a, a short time during the year. Um, strawberries and cream is synonymous with Wimbledon, and um, they're served there every year. And so those are some fun facts about strawberries and cream. So happy National Strawberries and Cream Day, happy National Weight Staff Day, and happy World Whiskey Day.